I know I look like your babysitter. <laughs> I know. I look like a really good babysitter because I just look nice but not quite hot enough to ruin a marriage. <laughs> uh, when I first moved to LA, <sighs> I had someone ask me if I was going to change my name for the stage. My name is Esther Pavitsky. They said, are you going to change your name for the stage? And I said, no. I thought about it. I like Pavitsky. It's unique. And then he looked at me and said, no, I meant Esther. <laughs> and I was like, oh, right, I forgot. Both my names are ugly. I don't just sound like a Polish cabbage farmer. <laughs> I sound like a very old Polish cabbage farmer. <sighs> Whatever, I'm hot. <laughs> For my name. <laughs> you know it's true. When they say Esther Pavitsky and I walk out, you're like, okay. <laughs> okay, yeah. But literally, if someone was just like, this is my friend Ashley, you'd be like, ew. <laughs> Ashley's like awkward. Does she look like her dad? I get the feeling she looks like her dad. <laughs> I once had a guy tell me that I was the kind of girl you'd have sex with in your car, but not your house. <laughs> I was like, thank you, officer. Uh, you may not be able to tell this uh, from looking at me and my height, but I was breastfed. <laughs> I was actually breastfed too long, and the reason I know this is because my mom tells me it was really easy to get me to stop breastfeeding, because she could just say to me, we're done now, and I understood her. <laughs> mm. And I guess I actually responded and said, yeah, mom, I have to go to work. but I'm really hungry. <laughs> Can you pump me a snack for later? <laughs> Look, that's a joke, okay? That's not true. But what is true is I was breastfed too long, and the real reason I know I was breastfed too long is because I fucking remember it. <laughs> that's right. And I feel very confident that if I didn't remember being breastfed, I wouldn't be on this stage right now. <laughs> no, I'd be out there having fun with all of you. It would be great. <laughs> it's just, it's messed up that my first memory of being alive is of hooking up with my mom. <laughs> you don't want that. My mom is hotter than me, and I'm not just saying that because we did hook up. Uh, <laughs> and my, I don't mean like she was hotter than me at my age. No, my mom is actively hotter than me. My mom is hotter than me right now. And people hear that, and they don't want to believe it. They're like, what do you mean? No, no, no. And I'm like, no, it's really simple. I'll explain it to you. Here's what happened. My mom met an ugly guy. He had a house, and she wanted it. So she had sex with him, and here I am. <laughs> I know I look like a person, but I'm a real estate transaction. <laughs> uh, guys, I'm 31, and I recently met another 31-year-old who owned their own home. And I was like, bitch, stay in your house. No one wants to meet you. <laughs> it made me feel so insecure and so bad about myself. And then I was like, you know what? No, I'm not going to let this take me down because I'm not doing that bad. I could own my own home really soon if everyone in my family dies at the exact same time. <laughs> I could own my own home and a 2009 Honda Accord. <laughs> Ivan Esther, thank you.